you just got GTA 5 online, you're a new player, and you just got $4 million. Now you're looking at this criminal career screen and wondering, what do I do? Which one to pick? In this video, I'll be covering the executive criminal career path, showing you the best bane for your buck, and get you started on the right foot in GTA online as a new player. So when you go here, you gotta pick an office, a warehouse, a vehicle, weapons, and this is your summary page on how much you spent. Now, you guys, I know what you're thinking. You're like, I'm gonna spend the least amount of money. I'm gonna keep the most amount of money. Well, guys, that's not how it works. You gotta spend at least $3 million and then pocket a million dollars if you're lucky. But let's start with the build, okay? So go to your office. Now, the best office in the game, in my opinion, would be the Arcadius building, but for purposes of this video and you just starting out, let's just go right into the meat and potatoes and let's go for the Maze Bank West and then also a garage so you have your car that's accessible right there. Your warehouse, let's go big, 42 crates, 902,000, you look at the location, not too far from Maze Bank, so then you can run back to Maze Bank and so on and so forth. Now for vehicles, this is obviously a preference, but what I would suggest to you is I would get the Armored Karuma. This is a really good car, especially for new players. For weapons, I would go with, you know, the Marksman Rifle, a Shrewsbury Combat Rifle, Bullpup Shotgun. Let me know what type of combos you guys would pick in the comments. I'm kind of curious. Summary page, you've already spent 3788000 you got 211,000 remaining that you can spend in the world in GTA Online. Go to start career and you're good to go. If you guys like the video, please leave a like. If you're new, drop a sub and don't forget to ding those bells. With that being said, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace!